All right, after all the fun, the festival-like atmosphere, we eventually play a baseball game. And for those that missed my 6 p.m., I talked about pitching taking over after last night's hitting challenge, and it did. Here come the game balls, which lets me say, get to the chopper! Get to the chopper! North Stars bottom of the first, guess who? Michael Chavis of the hometown Sox coming through with the liner to center and the double and two RBIs to another North Stars. Here we go. Salem's Chad De La Guerra with the rip to right for the double. Anderson Miller, though, cut down at the plate. Great play to keep the score just 2-0. The North Stars allowed just five hits and no runs in a 2-0 win over the South. Salem's All-Star Michael Chavis is your game's MVP, and our own MVP, Eric Johnson, has more from Salem. After an electrifying hitting challenge on Monday night, the bats were rather quiet here tonight for the All-Star Classic. After Michael Chavis batted in two runs in the first frame, it was defense from then on. The North was able to keep the South off the scoring column. Pitchers combined for eight strikeouts. The South combined for four Ks, but the damage from the first inning had been done. Yeah, going in there, trying to pound the zone, not walk anyone. That was my only goal. Uh, and then following up all the other scoreless innings, you know, we, we couldn't have done much. Of, couldn't have done much better than that. Salem star Michael Chavis was named the MVP of tonight's classic. We kept talking pregame about how I'm just trying to have fun and how everybody's just going to enjoy this experience. And uh, I went up there, got a good pitch to hit, and uh, I took care of it, and I was pretty uh, happy with how it ended up. It's all business from here as teams look to the second half of the season. Both Salem and Lynchburg return to action on Thursday night. In Salem, Eric Johnson, WSLS 10 Sports.